Which 2021 W Mint Mark coin is the more exclusive coin to collect? Let's find out. Silverstruck here. Welcome to the Silverstruck channel. 2021 is a great year to be a coin collector. Both the United States Mint and the Royal Canadian Mint have released low mintage silver one ounce coins with W Mint Marks. The coins are both one ounce of silver and proof strikes, but that is where the similarities end. Alright, so let's start by checking out the good old American ASE. And here we have the obverse of the coin. And it is a 2021 proof strike. Let's flip it over to its reverse. And on the reverse of this coin, we have the traditional heraldic eagle. And to the bottom left-hand side of this coin, you'll see the W mint mark. And that stands for West Point. West Point is the facility that minted this coin. This is the last coin in a long series spanning all the way from 1986 to have the Heraldic Eagle Reverse. Later this year, the reverse will change to the Type 2 Reverse, making this American Eagle very collectible because it's a coin that closes out the very last in a series. But does that make it exclusive or rare? No, not really. The product limit of the coin is 327,440. If you recall back in 2020, the 2020 S Mint from San Francisco had a mintage of 200,000 to the proof strike. Better than that, the 2020 V75 Privy had a mintage of 75,000. So, in the world of proof strike American Eagle coins, it is a lower mintage, but nowhere close to the lowest mintage and really not that exclusive of a coin. Now let's check out the Canadian coin. And you might already have noticed this coin has a little bit different of a finish. Instead of the mirrored fields that we're used to seeing, this coin has diagonally lined fields and kind of a matte satin finish. Let's flip it over to its reverse. And on the reverse we have the exact same diagonally lined fields and you can see the traditional maple leaf. This has kind of a reverse proof uh, style strike to it, if you will. And you'll see the W mint mark. And that W stands for Winnipeg. Winnipeg was the facility that minted this coin for the Royal Canadian Mint. So pretty neat coin. Definitely glad to have it in, the connect, in, in my collection. The 2021 W mint mark Canadian maple leaf comes with a certificate of authenticity. Here we have it right here, and I will turn it, turn it to a certain page. We'll first look at this page right here. We'll show you the English part of the page, so you can pause the video and read if you like. And then I'm going to flip this over, and here's another part of the Certificate of Authenticity to read. But then we're going to look at the French part. Let me draw your attention down to the bottom right of the certi Certificate of Authenticity. And you'll notice there's a mintage number there. And that mintage is 8,000. But before that number, there's another number, 3,654. And that's the really neat part of this particular coin. This coin is number 3,654. And I just find that incredibly intriguing that the Canadian Royal Mint actually has certificates of authenticity with numbered coins. So you know exactly what number of coin you have in the series. And that brings me to a whole other point and maybe even a little bit of a gripe. So let's get into that and see if you agree or disagree with my point of view. So here we have a 2016 W Mint Mark American Eagle. And this one has a lettered edge. But I'd like to draw your attention to one particular phrase on this slabbed coin. And that is the phrase early release. There are other phrases that grading companies toss around. First day of issue, first strike coins, early release. And all of these, in my opinion, are the grading companies trying to get extra premiums out of us for buying these types of slab coins. Do we really know if this is an early release coin? What is an early release coin? How about a first strike coin? How many coins are first struck? 10? 100? 100,000? Where do they draw that line? 
So I've always long disliked having to buy slabs with early release. This is the only one I have. I don't have any first strike slabs. I just won't buy them personally because I feel like it's just the grading companies putting their hand out and trying to get more of a premium uh, for that particular type of coin. What I like about what the Royal Canadian Mint has done with that 2021 W Mint Mark is that if you have the 0001 coin, you truly have the first strike coin. Uh, and so having a numbered coin like that and being able to keep track of it, you know exactly what you really have. And it's it's right there. There's only going to be one certificate of authenticity uh, with the 0001, 2, 3, so on and so forth. And I just uh, really like that particular detail of the coin. So that said, if you ask me which coin I feel has a more appealing design, I'm going to have to say that the American Silver Eagle by far has the better design. That's my personal preference to the coinage. I really think that the American Eagle has a very timeless classic design. And, uh, you know, I'm not entirely convinced the Type 2 is going to do nearly as good of a job, but I am excited to see what the Type 2 Reverse looks like. But what coin is more exclusive to own? And I would have to say that's the 2021 W Mint Mark Canadian Maple Leaf with a mintage of 8,000 8, and uh, numbered coins with a certificate of authenticity. So which coin do you feel is the more exclusive coin? Feel free to share your thoughts in the comment section. Please don't forget to hit that like button if you're interested in more videos about silver and gold stacking or coin collecting. Consider subscribing. If you select that notification bell, you'll be notified when I post a new video. Thank you so much for watching.